I'm Zach Hennessy, and today me and my brother JJ hey guys. are going to be reviewing movies for the Oscars. Since we're not old enough to see the movies yet, me and JJ said, why don't we judge the movies by their posters? So that's what we're going to do. You ready, JJ? Yeah. Boom! Boom! Hey, JJ, since we're talking about the Oscars, you want to tell me who you're wearing? I got this from the 99 cent store. My belt is from... Macy's and these are from Abercrombie and I'm wearing hair gel. Seems like you copied my style. No, this is my style, boy. And if it's your style, who are you wearing? All right, let me tell you a little about, about my outfit. These are from my stockings that mama gave me and these jeans are from Kohl's. Where's your bow tie from? This is from Spencer's for the ladies. The first movie we're going to be doing is The Martian. Hey, JJ, what do you think of the poster? The title sounds like it's about space. Looks like he might be getting stuck in space forever, and looks like he might get killed at the end of the movie. I think this movie, it looks like all the other space movies, like he's going to get trapped in space, and he can't get home, and he's going to have to kill the Martians. It doesn't look like an interesting topic to me. So if you don't think this movie is interesting, at the score of 10, what would it be? Five, because people are gonna see it because it's got a famous actor in it, Matt Damon, you know? Everybody loves him. Just like everyone loves Raymond, that show. What do you think of this movie? Well, I think this movie is about a neighborhood and they lose all their money because they're gambling or something. And a lot of famous actors are in this movie. Based on all the actors, who is your favorite actor on this movie? Christian Bale. Mine too, because he played in Batman. <laughs> I think the theme of this movie is about, it's about a bunch of business guys and they're trying to create a company where they produce movies because it's called Spotlight and they put the camera in front of people. It doesn't have a lot of good actors in it, so I don't think it did that well. I think this movie is about like them having a meeting a lot of times in the movie. Every single day they have meetings. It's an R-rated movie and it looks super boring. Not for Zach. What do you think this movie is about? I think it's about a girl named Brooklyn who has to move to Brooklyn, but they're both named Brooklyn, and she has to get a job because she's broke and it looks like the time period would be around the 1800s. I think this movie's about a guy, he looks like a superhero to me and he has to fight bad guys because there's like blood everywhere around him and he has to fight them. Based on this picture, do you think he did a good job acting in this movie? I think Leonardo DiCaprio, I think he did um, a really good job, but it looks like he had to act really hard in this movie. It looks like he was actually out in the snow. So the next movie is called Root. I think this movie is about a kid and a mom. They can't get out of this room, so someone eventually saves them at the end of this, and that's why it's called Room. Who do you think saves them from the room? His dad. You think they're th their husband? Or maybe the police come because maybe like a murder trapped them in this room. Whoa, what do you think this movie's about, sir? Well, brother, they are driving and the husband is going mad and his name's Max and he goes mad and he, he gets in car crashes and stuff. <laughs> what car do you think they're driving? I think they're driving probably a Nissan Pathfinder. Out of all these posters, do you think this movie's exciting? Yeah, it looks pretty exciting. Based on the movie posters, me and JJ decided that Mad Max will win the Oscars this year because it had the most exciting poster. Right, JJ? Yep. Go! <laughs> now we're going to do the Mad Max dance. <laughs> 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 <laughs>